We're used to seeing delivery drivers working hard throughout the day, but according to a group of community members on the Nextdoor app, they're getting deliveries late into the night, and it's leading to some frightening situations for the customers and drivers. Emily Bloom talked to a delivery driver today to hear what's keeping them out so late. With the Christmas holiday just over a week out, you're probably anxiously awaiting the arrival of a package or two. Something that you're going to want to keep in mind, though, is that these delivery drivers could be out past 10 p.m. at night. Well, we can pretty much work from 9 a.m. all the way up until 11 p.m. This UPS driver who chose not to go on camera isn't complaining. They love what they do and take pride in their job, adding they're treated really well by the company. We have amazing benefits, so it's pretty much worth it. Plus, we're Santa. But don't be surprised if Santa shows up in a big yellow Penske truck or an orange U-Haul. UPS runs short on their brown trucks this time of year when the volume doubles. So a lot of people get weirded out when rental trucks are coming onto the property 9, 10, 10, 30 at night. Sometimes. With a change in hours and delivery methods, these unsung heroes of the holidays are being mistaken. There's been a few times where people have had guns pulled on them because people don't understand that. If they don't see the UPS brown truck, it's just the rentals. There's a discussion circulating on the next door app with quite a few people commenting about deliveries past 7 p.m. in the Spokane area. Weather conditions only complicate things for these delivery drivers who are doing their best to get packages to you safely. Pretty much doubles our time on the road. UPS delivery hours go until 9 p.m. If you want to shorten that window, you can do it through UPS My Choice. If you see a rental truck late at night or your doorbell, it's probably us. <laughs> Just trying to get these packages off in time for Christmas. If you'd like to show a token of your appreciation, I'm told that a bottle of water, a treat, or even simply just a thank you goes a very long way. Reporting in Spokane, Emily Bloom, 4 News Now.